This painting by Botticelli is a quote from a lost work by the ancient Greek painter Apellis, created to respond to the infamous slander made by an envious colleague of conspiring against King Ptolemy. The figures are either personifications of vices or virtues, or in the case of the king and victim, of the roles of the powerful and the powerless. On the throne, King Midas has the donkey's ears, and ignorance and suspicious grasps these as they speak into them. The king extends his hands towards calumny, but rancor holds his hands towards the king's eyes to obscure their view so that he cannot see the scene. Perfidy in red and yellow and fraud behind arranges calumny's hair. Slender in white and blue and holding a flaming torch is pulling forward by the air the innocent half-naked victim on the floor. Repentance in black looks towards naked truth, pointing upwards to the heaven to indicate the only true source of justice. The reason why Botticelli chose this theme are unknown. If like Apellis, he intended to claim his innocence in the face of a false accusation. The slandered innocent could even be Savonarola or the banker Antonio Segni, to whom, according to Vasari, Botticelli had donated the painting. It is part of the last phase of Botticelli's production, characterized above all by an inner crisis that led him to radically transform his style. He adopted for his most famous masterpieces, focusing on strong plastic of the figures, a more decisive chiaroscuro, and strong theatrically in the movements of the protagonists. Sandro Botticelli, Calumny, 1495.